guys come spend the day of my birthday with me all day i'll walk you through i'll probably do a voiceover a lot throughout this video but this is just me waking up i did my morning prayer and then i laid my bed i can never leave my room without making my bed i just feel like my day becomes chaotic when my bed is unmade and i've left my room so i make my bed immediately I wake up and then I open my window so I can get some fresh air in my room and then I drink my cinnamon and clove water and then I head to the bathroom. In the bathroom, the first thing I do is brush my teeth. So I've been using Colgate toothpaste all my life. I think it's the best toothpaste I've ever used and uh, yeah, no complaints. Every vari variation of Colgate I use and then after that, I scrape my tongue. I scrape your tongue. You can't have a milky tongue in 2024. And then I mouthwash. Yes, I mouthwash after brushing. Don't judge me. And then I wash my face. I only use my hands to wash my face in the morning. And then I wash. I use a washcloth to dry. And then I use my Porsche M oil. That's it. And then later on during the day, I decided to take a shower. The first thing I use is my shower gel. Is a Sanex Pro Hydrate shower gel is the first thing I use. And then after that, I go then I go in, um, I go in with my Dove body exfoliator because I was doing the most this day because it's my birthday. So I exfoliated with my Dove and then I go in with my body shop bath blend. It's like a foam. I love it. It smells so good. It's mango. And then after that, there's this body foam that I bought from Primark recently. It leaves the skin so smooth. I, t I kid you not. Anyways, after I'm done, I go in with my oil, Vaseline body oil immediately after the shower. And then Porsche M skin oil right after that. And then I leave the shower. And then when I get to my room, guess what? Then I apply lotion. So my uh, body lotion is Porsche M. And then I deodorant. This time I was driving. I wanted to drive out to go and run some errands. And then so I used... Uh, what is this? Zara perfume. Applied some lip gloss. Of course, you must layer up. It's in the UK. It's a bit cold. And then I just, you know, moisturized and oiled my hair. I, yeah, it's just a running errands kind of day. So something simple as long as you are layered because the weather. The weather in the UK is a mess and it's unpredictable. And then I put on my earrings and folded my towel and I was ready to go put on my socks. And then I remembered I needed to make a list. The worst thing they can do you can do is go to the store without making a list. You end up buying more than you need and forgetting what you needed. So I made my list. And then it was time for me to go uh, open the door. I think the worst thing about living in this house is opening the gate for yourself. So you drive, you open the gate, you drive out, you close the gate. It's a lot. So this is me just getting out, the, getting the car out first. And then going back to close the gate. Guys, I need a remote control gate. Anyways, I got out and then it's time to drive to the store. I decided to have some gum. Can you see how good I look in my GMP cap? All the way from Namibia, guys. Get you a GMP cap. Anyways, I drove to the town center because I just needed to go to Aldi. Um, And it was like a four-minute drive from my place to Aldi. So didn't take long and then I parked in my favorite parking spot. I found it right open. I love parking there. Anyways, I got out of the car and I walked in it. It was drizzling a bit, but not so much. So I quickly rushed and I didn't carry an umbrella. So I rushed to Aldi to just pick up a few things and I didn't film in store. I don't know why I forgot. This is me literally coming out. I just bought some stuff because I needed to make platters because my friends were coming over for pre-drinks before we go out. As I said, it's my birthday. But in Aldi, there are some things that I could not find in Aldi that I specifically needed to get from Tesco. So I decided to, I had to drive to Tesco after. So I just put the stuff in the car and I drove to Tesco. This is literally just me revising and out out of the parking honestly the sun was sunning a bit imagine it was raining when i went entered aldi when i came out it was sunny uk weather is bipolar i kid you not anyways i got to tesco and um 
this is just me walking in yes i needed a trolley i was just getting four things a few things but i needed to get a cake it's my birthday after all and i got some salami and some ham and the thing that i wanted the most is martini i've got two bottles and then i remembered i needed to pick up a parcel from impulse this is like a self help you just enter your phone number and a code that they had sent you on your phone and then you, it's the the locker open, then you pick up your parcel. It's automated. It's it's self service. It's so convenient. So I needed to pick up that parcel, and then it's time for me to go back home, um, so I can do a platter because my friends are coming back over later. I didn't go to school today, so I stayed at home because I wasn't feeling so great. So they're coming back. They're coming to mine. For pre-drinks, as I said, I'm repeating myself. Anyways, this is me driving back home. I drove by the gym and the hustle of opening the gate again and then getting back in the car and driving in. And then this is finally me at home. I made two platters, a sweet one and a savory one. The sweet one had like fruit and, you know, and uh, meringues and cookies. And, you know, there is the, there is it. So I put some strawberries there and then the savory one just had meats and cheese and crackers and olives. I love olives and gherkins. Anyways, yeah. Then they they came. They brought me presents. I'll open them tomorrow. And flowers. I'll open them tomorrow. And then I'll show you guys. I'll include it in this video. And we had some prosecco. And then it was that it was late. We were missing the bus, so I had to quickly go and do my makeup. Um, because we were going with the bus, I wasn't gonna drive to go out because I was gonna drink, you know. And I didn't want that responsibility of having to uh drive back while i have had drinks anyways so the bus was leaving in a few minutes so i had to rush through this makeup it was so plain and so simple and also that outfit that i had bought i bought that it was a jumpsuit i bought it from quiz and it arrived literally that day of my birthday and i realized it was too short and it was cold that day so I wore it there, but then later you see you see later in this video I changed my mind from wearing it because I it's too short. And so when I wear it with like stockings, it, it, it didn't feel right. Anyways, I put on my wig and then I yeah, I later changed. Anyways, uh, we were done and we took the bus and we were in the city center and then I had my sash on that said birthday queen. Yeah, enjoy the video. Bong. It's a video. Yes, we kill us one day. You just, you just lose weight. Oh, how you be fat? Shit, we're done for the while walking to the venue we found this thing it's like i don't know it's like a just a thing in the middle of the city center where people are inside and then it just has lights it was weird it felt like a initiation kind of vibes it was giving cult guys anyways uh, we got to the bowling alley and uh, let the fun begin it was a bit packed uh, a little bit there was a queue we booked for like an hour session and we did i think two games so I think it's best to book an hour rather than booking a game uh, because it's cheaper when you book for an hour. Anyways, um, I was the first one to go, but the girl and all, and I, I didn't go, get off to a good start. Anyways, so that's the new outfit that I decided to wear. I decided to wear a dress. I have been having this dress for like a year now. I bought it, I think, my first week in the UK last year, and I have not worn it, so I decided to wear it for my birthday. Anyways, the pictures are on my Instagram it was so much fun um some of my friends had not arrived by then so we're just you know playing on their behalf as well but we did have a good time and uh yeah i'm honestly doing this voice over because there's music playing in the bowling alley and you know copyright youtube and 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 so i decided to just do a voice over over this you can't even hear what my friends are saying but they're literally just saying how much fun they're having and uh yeah, we also did do some drinks at the alley, but after our game of two games, we went somewhere else. Anyways, I am rambling again. Um, I didn't win any of the games, but 
you know, it's okay. It's not a strange match. I did not win, but I didn't come last. I came like third. So it's not bad. It's not bad. Um, and what's funny is one of my friends that came late, we were playing on his behalf and he came late and he ended up winning. So basically that's our win. You know what I mean? So anyways, um, yeah, if the bowling alley is in the city center right by Nelson Street, if you're ever in Bristol and you're looking for bowling, you can check them out. It's called The Lanes. Uh, this is not a, a paid advert. It's called The Lanes. Uh, you can check it out online on their website. Uh, the hospitality is great. The hosts are really, really nice. And it was good vibes. It was really good vibes. And it felt like a family kind of bowling alley they also do like karaoke and stuff we did not book for karaoke nobody was in the mood for that anyways uh people were hitting like all the pins at once i did that a few times but anyways i'm not one to toot my ho own horn that is a bad bad throw anyways <laughs> the number of times i've said anyways with this voice note uh, what is it voice over what is it yeah voice over right Anyways, you see, there I go again. Hey guys, good morning. Ah. Uh, it's the day after my birthday. Look, I even slept without covering my hair, putting a bonnet on. Yes. Last night was epic. Last night was epic. My God. Um. Yeah. It's almost ten, and uh, we're gonna do something I didn't do yesterday. We are going to open my gifts. So I'll open my birthday presents. <sighs> oh Lord. Mm -hmm. It's 10. I only want to do that for. Uh. Mm, last night was so good. Oh my God, we went bowling. And after that, we went for drinks, cocktails, and dinner. And then after that, we went dancing. Guys, I have not danced like that in such a long time. In such a long time. Oh. But I loved it. I loved it. It was really so nice. And uh, I'm grateful to my friends for coming through. Because it's hard getting friends to come together. But we did. Anyways, we're supposed to go to the spa today, but we didn't book on time, so the spa is fully booked, unfortunately. And it would have been so great to just go and relax. Anyways, let me go. Let's go so I can open my presents that I got from my friends yesterday. And also the house is a mess, because when we left for the city center yesterday, we were rushing. Because we had to go with the bus. I wouldn't drive because I knew there were shots going to be taken. So I didn't drive. We took a bus. So we were rushing for not to miss the bus. And everything in the house is a mess. Starting with my room. Look. My work phone on the table. I don't even know why. <laughs> Anyways. Oh, Lord. Let's go. Let me start with this one. Let me start with it. I don't like it to be a blanket. Yeah, I'm going to Back, right? I knew right she was my secret son. Oh wow. <laughs> oh, hand cream. Oh wow, this is a lot of hand cream. Oh nice. 
guys. It's so soft. Of us. Oh, okay. It's bubble, 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 I'm taking a bubble bath. Oh wow! Yeah, Zin! It's fit for my feet! Why are you people listen to me when I talk about my problems? Talk to me! This is so nice! This is so nice! The city I was watching yesterday. Grind. I 
I saw that you put your on the phone. Crap! 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 It's the insult for me! Like you've never been on the To be realistic, you like when buying gifts to guys.